this course is meant to push you to your limits and it, it does, but it's exciting and I find myself totally getting drawn into everything I'm doing and um, yeah, it's good fun. This course can be for school leavers, but it's also a really good opportunity for students who are working and also those perhaps with families and other commitments because there's a lot of flexibility in the way we work. Performance, creativity, use of technology, listening, academic writing and so on, and working in community or in education or in business. And the other thing is about any musician's welcome, all sorts of genres. Students on the course will be involved in doing things like composition, recording, performance, um, maybe composing for film, and um, also there's quite a lot of ensemble and practical work. We use a lot of collaborative technology and, and ways of working so that our students can work together, although they're not in the same location. So we use file sharing and we work online and build projects together with our students wherever they're based. The fact that everything's done via distance learning means everything's really flexible and it allows me to get more work in music on the side. I do a lot of gigging and I do a little bit of teaching as well and there isn't really any conflict between being able to do that and getting my uni work in on time. A lot of the time I'm in mainland Scotland, I'm in Shetland, I'm in France, I'm occasionally on a boat off the coast of the UK and I can tap into the course wherever I am, I can push on with my studies regardless of where I am, which is a massive advantage. The course is delivered using what's called blended learning and that means a combination of online and video conference and also four residencies that take place at different times during the year at different locations throughout Scotland. The residential has been really exciting. This is my first time in Stornoway and it's just packed with lots of exciting things that I've never done before, like Sam singing and uh, step dancing, which I did last night. My feet are very sore. And um, well, obviously the, the reason we're here is the exam, the big exam. So I had mine yesterday, it's over. <laughs> Hopefully uh, I've passed. The social aspects I think are important. I think residencies are really important because the majority of us are distance learners so we don't physically meet people on a daily basis. So for when we come in residency, socially it is important because it's the only time we all really get together and see each other. Well, at other residencies there's a, a balance between the formal activities and the informal, more fun activities and that really I guess involves the fact that students are here as a big group of musicians in a location they've perhaps not been together before so there's really great opportunities to, to play together informally and that usually happens whatever we do we have open mic nights set up for students to have that chance to perform we have opportunities that we plan where they have more formal performance experiences but there's a lot of music being made all the time Music is a social function, social activity. So we create a community of practice, rapport, relationships, and these carry through the weeks when we would never meet and people go back to their own towns and homes scattered across the highlands or anywhere, and then they come back together. So this creates a real dynamism about the delivery pattern, face-to-face -face as well as um, online and through VC.